Hi, and welcome to another exciting Excel Q&A by ExcelMonster.com. And today, we want to look at something Jerry sent yesterday. He says, how do I create an if e function with two conditions? That pretty much interesting and um, a very familiar question, I guess. Uh, you sometimes have need of one if statement to solve a problem. In this example, we have a commission of 2% to be paid to any of these sales guys provided he's a commission employee and then the revenue generated is more than thousand bucks so how do we fix this well you first would want to type the if statement okay now the trick happens in the logical test you know the logical test is the is a condition you set for your, your your if statement so what you want to do is to go for the end function what the end guide does is to check whether all arguments are true so it's basically going to check for uh, both conditions you want to specify and see if they are both true okay so what you do is to first go to cell b2 and say b2 is equal to commission i'm putting that in double quotes as you can see it's not case sensitive let me just make them lower case and um if b2 is commission and the revenue c2 is greater than thousand i don't expect the first guy to end a commission even though he's a commission employee type okay so comma value if true i want you to go ahead and multiply uh, the, the value of the revenue generated by 0.02 that would give me the two percent and then if it is not true well return nothing okay return nothing control enter and then i double click to fill across and you can see that some guys are actually earning a two percent commission because they are more than uh the, the they are commission employees and then the revenue generated was more than thousand let me just make this 500 and see and that guy is going to lose the commission okay thank you hope you enjoyed this see you some other time on another excel q a